Good morning, y'all. Happy Monday, January 28th. I am here at my lunch spot. And I gotta run in to the restroom. And But I've already been at one customer this morning. I'm getting ready to eat my lunch. I've got two more customers today. So, um, I have a very busy day, y'all. But, um, and I've got a phone call to make also. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and run to the restroom and start my lunch. And I'll show you my lunch in a minute. Okay, y'all. This is going to be my lunch. Um, four egg cups. Guacamole. Sunflower seeds. And I'm going to add this in my water. That's my lunch today, y'all. All right, I got to get after it so I can get on to my next client. Y'all can see um, the fisherman out there He's collecting his traps. And the birds come out there and check to see if he's got anything. <laughs> Smart birds. There's three of them out there. I don't know if you can see. <laughs> They're like, don't you have anything for me? Sorry, I'm so shaky. Hey guys, I had my lunch. Um, I did have, let me show you. I'm trying to eat these up. They're full of carbs though. Um, I ate half of one of these. Just to give me the fuel I need to keep on with my day because like I said, I have a super busy day today and a lot of work. Um, I've ate my lunch. I made my phone call. I am getting ready to head on to my second client. And it is freezing me outside. And um, the windows are fogging up back there. It's a little chilly. Um, anyway, so um, I've got another potential customer that I'll probably land on Friday. So I've got to go see them on Friday after all my work's done and um, see what they're needing and all that fun stuff. But anyway, and I'm working on some other ideas and things um, for other businesses besides my YouTube. My YouTube is also a business to me. Um, even though I don't make any money at it, it's still a business to me. And one day I will make money at it, but for right now, I don't make any money, but you have to put in the time in order for you to re reap the, say that again, to reap the rewards. Say that six times. Um, <laughs> anyway, so I am going to talk about that at another time, um, but I've been in the process of figuring that stuff out for quite a while. Anyway, I'm going to get on with my day so I can get this client out of the way and get on to my next customer, which is one that I'm not too enthused about, but it helps pay the bills. Um, and why I say I'm not too enthused about it is it's an older couple. They're real nice, real sweet, but they constantly chitty chat and drive you bonkers with calls and texts and, um, and um, constantly, oh, can you do this, can you do that type thing um, that's not originally on the schedule um, from day one. So sometimes they can be a pain in the hiney, but I am very thankful um, because that's what helps pay the bills right now. So anyway, all right, I am off to my client and off to make some money and be successful. I'll talk to you later. Hey y'all, I am freezing my buns off. It's cold. But today I'm going to make peanut butter cookies. I'm using a recipe in this cookbook that I have, but I'm altering it to be keto friendly. So I'm going to make some peanut butter cookies. And let's get started. Yeah. So I had to melt the butter 
um, in the peanut butter because it was too cold to melt by itself. So I melted that in a bowl ahead of time. I guess I went overzealous on the size of the bowl because I'm used to mix hand mixing it, so I automatically went to the biggest bowl. But whatever works for me, I guess. So that'll get that started. I'm trying this one today. I don't know. I need to read the directions, see what works best for what. But I just roll with it, y'all. So I'm doing half cup of butter, half cup of peanut butter. I'm going to do a half cup of stevia. I got my coffee, y'all. Actually, it's coffee with cocoa. Because I'm so cold today. I made two cups. I got one in the microwave up here. Um, I did half of black coffee and then half of a cocoa pod in each one so yeah that's what I'm doing right now having probably a little bit more sugar than I should be but I separated it up out of one pod so all right now we're doing a half a cup of brown sugar it says but I got this um, Truvia splend splend this Truvia blend if I can get it out without spilling it everywhere okay so I got Truvia blend brown sugar half a cup it's not quite a full it's all good all right half teaspoon of my baking soda powder aluminum free and that's done and half teaspoon of vanilla I'm just gonna eyeball it that's good let's hope that was vanilla <laughs> it was I'm putting my egg, one egg. Hopefully no shells are in there. It's a rainy day today, y'all. It's a good day to stay inside. All right, I'm gonna mix this up. Then I'll add in my flour. and smooth and creamy and now I'm going to add in my flour it says one and a fourth cups of regular flour but I'm doing almond flour and I'm going to just do one cup of flour Let's see how that does so it's not too dry or too dense this up I push down the sides always stuff up on the sides it flips it up above the actual beater part so you gotta get it back down there 
oven is on 375. I put my parchment paper down on my baking sheet. Sorry, it's so loud. And then I'm going to go ahead and dish out the cookies. Get this um, sheet off here or try to get all the dough off of it. It's not sticking too bad because it is peanut butter, so it's got lots of oil in it. Okay. And now I will dish out the old cookies and I just eyeball the amount of dough. I'm no professional. I just do whatever floats my boat. I don't have anybody here that wants it a certain way. It's just me. I'm not trying to be professional. I don't know how many cookies this makes. I'll have to check. Check it out find out. This is the best way to do it. It's not going to make as much as it probably says because I didn't put the extra fourth of uh, almond flour in there. I only put one cup. <clears throat> it's freezing outside today and it's rainy. I'm all bundled up. I've been turning the heat on and off so I figure I might as well bake some cookies. Oh, I was wanting cookies anyway, but... Um, figured I might as well bake some cookies and let the oven run, heat up the house, do two with one, not wasting electricity, I'm getting double my rewards out of running the electricity once for heat, so yeah, that's what I'm doing, saving money, y'all, and all this stuff. I mean, obviously, you see me buy the eggs the other day because I needed eggs, but all this stuff I've already had, so I didn't go shopping for any of this, and I used up all my peanut butter, so now I have no peanut butter, but anyway, let me put these out on the sheet here. I got them on the sheet. I got to flatten them and put them in the oven. All right, y'all, it says to bake these for seven to nine minutes. Oven is on. It feels good. Putting these in the oven. I put parchment paper on it, so y'all know. I'm going to put the timer on for 7 to 9 minutes. It automatically sets it to whatever, 30 minutes or whatever. So I'm going to put it on for 8 minutes. Well, 8.41, I'll check it. Okay, y'all. I pulled the first batch out of the oven. The second batch is in the oven. And just waiting for those to get done and let these cool. Okay, y'all. Well, the other ones are in the oven. I am going to test, taste test. I never, I never can remember how to say it right. It's all right. You can laugh at me. Um, they're nice and soft. They're still warm though. So I'm gonna try one, see how it does. Tastes pretty good. And I'm sure when they're um, cooled completely too, you know how um, peanut butter cookies are so good. Like the next day and they get a little bit crunchy because they've been sitting there. These are probably going to be pretty awesome. I mean, they're pretty awesome now. I like them warm too. But the next day I think they're going to be even better. So, thumbs up on these cookies, y'all. And um, I'll try to remember to put the recipe below so y'all have it pretty simple and easy. I just altered a recipe out of a cookbook. Keto friendly. All right, y'all. Talk to you later. Remember y'all to live a simple, happy, healthy, tiny life.